Hello everyone, my name is Gustavo Mendes and I'm the product manager at Filmworks. Today we're going to be showing you DVO decompress inside Resolve using our DVOFX plugin suite. So, the issue that we have here for decompress is a footage that has an incredible amount of, no of compression artifacts. So, we not only have noise, but we also have macro blocking, we have bending. There are several issues with the footage, and that's what the VO decompress really shines with. So, considering the compression, let's see how this goes. So I'm going to get here this footage, and if I play back, you can see the squares very clearly of what's happening, so the footage doesn't have a lot of detail. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom in, I'm going to get here and apply the view decompress. And right off the bat, we can see that we already have fixed quite a lot of the macro blocking issues, so this is much better. So we also can clean up the edges a little bit more if you wanted to and we can create use an aggressiveness that's a little bit higher than safe so we can go like to a normal level and this will clean up a little bit more we have options for debending as well and we can actually force the file to re be reconstructed as 444 chroma using an extended range and we can also adjust sharpness of the footage we can also adjust a little bit of the contrast if we want and we can add a little bit of noise or grain to improve a little bit of the texture. So you can see here, I'm going to add it a little bit more. I'm going to remove it from colored. And if I zoom out and I press play, you can see that we have a file here. I'm going to zoom in again. And this is significantly better than what the original file was. So if we compare, you can see the difference on the macro blocking and this is significantly better. We can use other tools to improve this even further, for example, brick wall, but the compressor already helps significantly with your footage. Thanks for watching.